Hi, this is Suzette with Photoshop in a Minute. Today we're going to talk about how to use Clipping Mask to populate a template. Now I'm designing my album from my Alaska trip and this is a 10 by 20 page and I wanted four little squares of some of the flowers that I photographed there. But I didn't want to have to make judgment calls on exactly how to crop them. I wanted flexibility. The easiest way to do this and also the most flexible with regards to making an album with multiple pages is to use the clipping mask. So each one of these is in a placeholder. This is what my template looks like. It's only four little squares and each square is on its own layer as a little block with a layer style. All I need to do is put my images into each one. So let me show how quick and easy it is to populate a template like this with four images. First of all, I'm going to choose the layer I want to start with, which would be this first layer, layer one. Then I'm going to go select the image I want, like this one, and I'm going to drag it into my template. It should come in directly above it. The command is Control Alt G or Command Option G. Notice how it looks like it went into the box. You can see over here it's just clipped to the box so that it only shows where those pixels are showing. All I need to do now is transform, control or command T, and then hold shift as I size from the corner, and I can just size it down to look good in the little box. I just need to make sure that my image is a little bigger than the box so I don't see any gray hanging out. That was easy. Now let's choose the next image, and we'll go to another image, V to move, I'll drag it in. Control Alt G or Command Option G. Oh, now this one doesn't really need any transformation. That looks good just the way it is. This is Photoshop in a Minute, making Photoshop easy and fast.